growing up, um, we went to a lot of like art galleries and um, museums um, as a family. How do you kind of, um, you know, quantify like all, all these, um, the impact of all these things you do as a kid, you know? It's only kind of really later that you realise you know, wow, that really did kind of shape my, my head um, back then. All part of the rich tapestry of life. Christine Centenera and Josh Goot are the duo changing the way people shop for luxury fashion. Centenera is the current fashion director of Vogue Australia, and Goot is an independent Australian designer. Though they have been partners for years, the duo has only recently commenced a professional relationship. The result? A new disruptor label called Wardrobe NYC, here to reshape the landscape of luxury fashion. Being the formidable fashion duo they are, the pair realised that while they owned enormous wardrobes, they often stuck to the same or similar articles of clothing. And so with a desire to combat the fast fashion epidemic and provide people with luxury they can both afford and feel good about, Wardrobe NYC was launched. The real driving force is a kind of a deep feeling that we can actually achieve something great and I think that's what keeps us going. Structurally, the label presents as a capsule collection. Each season, only eight pieces for women and eight pieces for men are produced. The items can't be bought as separate, with buyers encouraged to purchase either a pack of four or the whole collection. For women, the pack of eight pieces consists of a coat, blazer, knit blouse, shirt, t-shirt, skirt and legging. For men purchasing the entire collection, you'll get a coat, blazer, hoodie, knit, skirt, t-shirt, trouser, and a pair of pants. The first collection is available in the most classic of color schemes, black and white. The entire collection is designed to be worn together and to provide the basics for your entire wardrobe. We need to look at yeah. what kind of image do we want to be making here. Goot told Vogue Australia, One of the core elements of the business is the culture of less. We design less and we will produce in limited quantities. In a way, it is anti-fashion because it is about practicality and the essential elements, crafted from the best textiles by the best people and with the best manufacturing standards. And because the model is direct to consumer, we can provide unprecedented value for true luxury goods. The blazer doesn't cut too deep into the waist, sleeves aren't too fitted, shoulders are never made to be too pronounced or too subtle. The pair have dubbed this design style democratic luxury, as it favours practicality without skimping on luxury. The result is a semi-androgynous and completely ageless style. That's what keeps us going, is the dream of actually um, doing something that perhaps hasn't been done before, building a great Australian fashion label. This first collection has been an exploration into suiting. However, the pair are looking to expand into other lifestyle areas for future collections. Goot told Refinery29, We like the idea of concepts specific to the season. And for the next spring release, we are looking into a travel or sports related collection. Wardrobe NYC is one to watch. They are here to disrupt the luxury fashion economy forever. <laughs>